Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to another Operation Realism review. That flow is very good. I like that. I think that's what we'll use. Uh, anyways, we're back over here on Operation Realism. Uh, the last episode that we had or the last review that we did uh, was over there on the construction sites. Uh, J&G Aviation saw this water mill in the background and wanted me to do a quick review on it. So I'm going to do a quick review on a water tower. Um, so yeah, you don't see a lot of water towers uh, in Minecraft. This is a very good looking one, and uh, I, I agree. It, it's very simple, uh, but it's very effective also. This is going to be the main highlight. I'll see if I can find something else to uh, to add to this. But anyways, this is the water tower. Uh, really easy design here. Uh, just uh, really simple circles on top, some slabs. Really, really easy. And I was trying to figure out what this says. It looks like it says... I thought it said dickhead, <laughs> but I see D-I-C-K-H-I, so that's where I thought it said dickhead, <laughs> that's where it got me, but then it went I-C-H, so dickitch, di dickitch, I guess, uh, and then some symbols over here for the uh, the company, I guess, or whatever it is that owns the water tower, uh, so yeah, not pretty easy design, uh, again, down here on the bottom, we got some nice big concrete pillars to hold uh, all that water up there and support it. Uh, nice evenly spaced here at the bottom. Uh, got a couple little cobblestone wall pieces. And then it looks like some pillars going up the middle. Yep, uh, quartz pillars for the ladder up in the center. And then we've got some bracing here. Just zigzagged really, really simply to make an X pattern in between the for the bracing. And then a couple beams right in the very center to give us some uh, added support. And around the outside there. You know what would actually make this even better? would be some iron uh, bars wrapped around the outside so it's kind of protecting you going up and in and uh, I think that would be a uh, a really nice addition to this now the only bad thing about it that I'm seeing is the ladder goes up into the water tower piece so I'm wondering if this needs a platform coming out and then going up again or is there a hole here that I'm missing I don't think I saw one and I'm pretty sure yeah so a little bit of a flaw here getting from here out around to the outside no big deal still a very nice water tower and uh <laughs> i give a nice uh three minute review on it so uh, let me look around and see if i can add anything else to this video all right guys i found something else to add to the water tower uh, i remember seeing this earlier it's a used car lot so again this is uh something unique something most people would not think about uh got the uh, really nice banners out front and a flag the flag poles really really simple design here Again, with the uh, nether brick fencing or cobblestone wall for the base probably is what they use there. And uh, using the uh, the flags, <laughs> these things right here, the uh, the banners, sorry, I haven't used these in a while, for uh, making the signs, used cars we buy. Is there an interior? Probably not. Oh, God, I think there is. Is the door open? Can I get in there? Yes, I sure can. Awesome. So we can look around together. So we got a nice little seating area over here. Got some TVs and... Uh, Obviously, there's there's still something bad going on on the server because <laughs> that is all over all the TVs. <laughs> uh, got a nice little reception area here for, uh, I guess, the uh, the secretary. And then we've got a couple little seating areas back here. Uh, submarine. <laughs> they get ready to uh, uh, wage war on the, uh, the nearest car dealership, I guess. <laughs> got some uh, management offices back here. Really nice design using up the space quite nicely and I like the front of those that's uh, what is that okay it's birch wood slab and purple carpet on top so that's nice even though it's not purple carpet it matches the wood or the birch very very nicely and a uh, nice little cabinet there cabinet there in the corner and then we have another what says financing yep the finance office here and this one's a little more cramped but it's all right good use of the space uh, a little water cooler here in the back, and then, of course, we've got to find the shitters, and uh, it is a unisex bathroom, so I guess everybody can have sex in here. <laughs> Anyways, uh, typical shitter and sink, uh, nothing fancy there, but we do have a shitter, and that makes Jag happy. You guys know that. Uh, so the rest of the parking area uh, over here, uh, we've got some spare tires and some cones, and I'm not quite sure what this here is. I haven't figured that out yet. If you guys know what it is, let me know. Is it the back of a semi? I think it is. I think that might be the back of a tractor trailer. Uh, and it's uh, 
the tires came in and that and it's it's just setting down on the ground maybe uh let me know what you guys think that is and uh, and we'll all agree to disagree in the comment section <laughs> again really nice use of the banners here the red white and the blue uh, i really like that some dumpsters on the outside here and then of course a uh, garage center over here for of course because you know it's a used car you're they're bringing it back <laughs> they're gonna have to work on it somewhere uh or fix it up before they put it on the lot either or uh, really nice design here guys uh, again if you haven't been over here to the operation realism server make sure you click the link down in the description go over to their website get their texture pack uh, use the ip address put it in it's 1.8 come over here and get inspired even all this little small stuff that uh, you don't think about they have and they do a wonderful job at detail so that's it guys like always i appreciate you watching remember to rate comment subscribe follow me on twitter and i'll catch you guys on the next one later.